This question is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your WordPress questions or tasks on demand. Again, that is a search filter for WordPress. If you look over here at the live demo, there's the first demo, which shows the search filter abilities over here on the right side. And for the second demo, uh, it has been moved to WooCommerce shop. So when you click on WooCommerce, you notice that here there are options to filter the categories. So this is what this search, uh, this is what this search plugin does. So I decided to install it on WordPress. So navigate to your WordPress, make sure you're logged in and head over to dashboard. Then head down to plugin and inside of the plugins, make sure you go search for add new and search for search filter. And you will see that there's this plugin here, which you can then click install now and then click activate. Head back to plugins after the inst the activation process is done. So if you've installed it correctly, you'll see the search and filter plugin here in plugins. So click into settings and scroll down and you will see here it says how to use. So this is the short code you use whenever you want the search uh, search and filter search to appear. So down here are the list of arguments that can be applied to this search and filter plugin. So I will copy this search and filter short code and head over to pages. So wait for it to load. So here is pages and I've decided to add the, the short code to new offer page. So this is the new offer page and I've already added the search and filter short code right here. And when you click preview, you'll notice that up here is the standard search option. So I can try that out by typing t-shirt and clicking submit. And you'll see it indeed it searches for t-shirts. So that works. So, so let's look at the second option where you can search categories. Right now it searches all categories, but I can search for college and then click submit. And here it says nothing found. So that means that there are no options that both have t-shirt and have college in them. So I will leave the search field blank. So that means search for anything as long as it has the college, as long as it is in the college category, click submit. And you'll notice that three options showed up and these are the three posts that I decided to put in the college category. So heading back, you'll notice that the last option to customize is the tag. And I tagged uh, a few posts with the category Mac. So when I click submit, it will show up two posts here. So this first post and the second post. So now you can click back. So that is how you use search and filter in WordPress.